In this video, you will learn how to compose and send an email using your Gmail account. I will go ahead and open the browser and type Gmail in the search page, then press enter. Gmail should show up at the beginning of the search results page. If it doesn't show up, just go to gmail.com. That will also take you directly to the Google sign in page. You may also see a page similar to this. Just go ahead and click on sign in. That will take you to the Google sign in page. If you don't have a Gmail account, for your convenience, I added a link in the description to the video on how to create a Gmail account. Next, I'll go ahead and sign in. On the left side, you'll see the menu pane. I'm going to click on the Compose button with the plus sign. This will open a new message window. There are three parts to the email. The first is, who you are sending it to. You need one or more recipients to send. The second one is, the subject. What is the email about? The third is the message, which goes in the body below the subject field. For this example, I'll go ahead by using the computer how to channel email address as the recipient. That way you can see how to compose and check your email. You can type one or more email addresses here. If the person is already on your contact list, you can just start typing their name. And it will appear below. Then you can press the enter key or the tab key to add the person. That way you can quickly add the email addresses this way. Another tip to add recipients is to hover over and click on the word to. A select contact pop-up will appear with your recipient's address book. You can select your recipients with a click. When you're finished, click on Insert. The CC stand for carbon copy. It basically just lets the person know that they are not the main recipient while still keeping them in the communication loop. The BCC stands for blind carbon copy. It is similar to the carbon copy except it hides the recipient's email address from everyone else. Next, click on the subject field and type a short subject on what the email is about. Next, in the body field, this is where you type the message. I will go ahead and type a test message. There are other options for sending an email. You can change the display text and change fonts, size, colors and much more. You can also send attached files such as PDF, image and other types. Insert a link to a web page in your message. Insert emoji. Insert files using Google Drive. Insert photo. Turn confidential on or off. Insert signature. Use this to add a signature that will appear at the end of every email you send. Typically a signature will include your full name and contact info. I would not recommend including your personal home address. Another cool feature on Gmail is the Schedule Send feature. You can pick the date and time to send your message. Check spelling is available by clicking on the three dots in the lower right corner next to the trash can. Next, I'll go ahead and send the message. If this video was helpful, be sure to give thumbs up and leave a comment. To receive video updates, please subscribe and click on the bell notifications. Thanks for watching Computer How to Channel. Computer tips and tricks with a click.